I come bearing good tidings. Uh, Google has rolled out a, a new beta feature called the Competitive Visibility Report. It's available inside a Google Merchant Center. It's kind of like Auction Insights, but more levels of analysis and then obviously specifically just for merchants. Let me show you um, about the Competitive Visibility Report. Benefits. I love when they just like say the most basic, uh, who your competitors are, how you compare against your competitors. Cool. I know the benefits of a competitive report, Google, but they give you some data points here. Relative visibility. Relative visibility shows how often your competitors' offers are shown compared to your offers. So it lets you know, it gives you a much better insight as to how big this market is or your market is. Page overlap rate, so how often you two are showing up against each other, and those are two very different metrics. Um, and then higher position rate, how often they win. Um, so kind of a Kind of a basic level reporting, but if you go into a Google Merchant Center under performance, you'll see competitive visibility. And then notice that I'm under your competitors. And uh, on the your competitors range, you can see all the competitors with the ones highlighted that are most applicable here. And then I can turn uh, uh, competitors on and off. Uh, these are all going to be blurred, so you're not going to be able to see who the competitors are. But you'll notice that like, some of them, like when I remove this competitor, it really narrows down the frame. And that's because like, I just removed Walmart. I don't mind showing you that one because it's not going to give away who my client is. Um, but as I'm removing some of these really big ones, uh, then the competition sort of um, narrows down, obviously. What's really interesting about this is it gives me some good insights. Like my, this particular client is in a very niche industry, and yet one of the competitors going up against them is tractorsupply.com which is interesting. And uh, upon further examination, it actually looks like tractorsupply.com is making a very significant mistake and showing up where they shouldn't be showing up because every single other competitor that I'm going up against is in our niche. And yet here's tractorsupply.com. They're not necessarily in our niche. So that's funny. Um, scrolling down, I can see all of the competitors. I can see the relative visibility. So this particular competitor is 1,500% higher in relative visibility. That means that they are spending an insane amount of money because this particular client of mine is actually spending a significant amount of money. I can see my page overlap rate and I can see higher position. So this is when they're beating me. Now remember, you don't always want to be higher position. Uh, that's not necessarily the most efficient place to be, but it's nice to see. And then over here, I can see top moichins. And in top moichins, um, I can see the, the merchants that are um, I'm going up against as an amalgamated value. So here are all the top merchants. Here's me. Um, and then I can sort of see where it is that we uh, where it is that we rank from a visibility perspective, which is actually pretty good. And you'll notice we took this campaign over on November 1st. So we haven't even had it for 15 days. We've had it for two weeks. And all of a sudden, for the first time ever, I'm consistently beating all the top merchants. And then you'll notice that this is just the, the day of drop that will uh, spike once uh, delayed attribution puts the data back. Uh, and then I can see in top merchants, the page overlap and higher position. Um, so super cool, super cool. But um, be careful with this data because it, 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 you could definitely start making decisions that aren't necessarily in your best interest, especially if you're not paying attention to things like the competitors that are showing up where they shouldn't be showing up, like the tractor supply people that I mentioned earlier. Somebody let Broadmatch go way too far. Um, and somebody's probably getting fired. Uh, that's all I got. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give us a thumbs up. That lets YouTube know we actually know what we're doing. We shoot a video every single day. So if you want to be notified, hit that subscribe button. And if you have any input, don't hesitate to hit us up in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. We get very little human interaction. Thanks for supporting our channel. And hopefully I'll see you tomorrow.